Okay, welcome to another Deal Structure Sunday with return veterans, Greg and Cammy Goucher, uh, high <laughs> sex associates and coaches. I, I just learned about the Goucher recently, but welcome to the call, guys. Welcome to the video, guys. Thanks, Chris. Thanks, Appreciate it. Um, that will be your new name officially because I just put it out there. Um, all right, so new deal. What deal number is this for you guys? Uh, seven. Okay, deal number seven. Mm -hmm. uh, just to wet their whistle, this deal and the last deal we did, if they didn't catch it, they should go see it. But the, the, these two deals together could be anywhere between 165 and 265,000 in three paydays. Two deals. Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, all right. So the source of this one for us, guys. Yeah, source is an expired. Expired listing. And once again, was this a slide broadcast or you dialing manually or a VA? This one was a manual dial. Uh, okay. during during COVID, we weren't, uh, I just did a lot of manual dials to get reach people and do uh, fill up our funnel. And that's what got this one. I love it. And this was just for a hint for these guys and they can go to the deal structure over time. This was bought very beginning of COVID time, right? Right. Or, awesome. right, or tied up. Right in the middle of it. Right in the middle of it. Right. Yep. Okay. So manual dial. How far, how far, how long from when you dialed, got the person on the phone to when you get a signed contract for a sandwich lease? Yeah, great. There's a little nuance on this. So by the time I got him on the phone and got first taken and sent in, uh, it was two weeks. But then we ran into an issue with the trust because there was a difference in name changes. So it actually- uh, I remember this. Okay, so nuances uh, during the overtime, guys. Very important lessons and nuances for you to hear. So make sure you hop over to the deal structure overtime later. Uh, remind me of that, Greg. That's a good one. Yep. Um, okay. So in the sandwich, as usual, for us, it's second nature, but uh, for the viewers, it might be new. We take a formula when we're thinking about sales price, but we don't talk sales price and we don't write it up in the contract. We write up, we're gonna give you this much cash on it before the end of the term, and we're gonna pay off your mortgage. So starting out, their mortgage was how much? $450,900, okay. And then their equity you're promising them at the end? Right, 145, 370. Okay, so that formula, so to speak, was like 595 ish? Correct. Mm -hmm. Okay, mm -hmm. uh, just for their reference. And, and so, again, I didn't say this in the last time I was with you guys, but the reason we do that is they get, the, the seller gets their cash of 145, but Cami and Greg used the, one, the 450 mortgage today. Well, it's not 450 in, in what, it's gonna be 60 months or less. Right. It's gonna be mm -hmm. a lot less. So 60 right. month term, I just gave that away. What are you selling it for? Uh, we already sold it, but. Yeah, 610. 610. So not much there, the, the viewer would think. So let's just keep going here. Uh, 610 sell price. Buyer deposit, payday number one, at signing and over time. So 61,000 plus the uh, monthly rent. Couldn't think of the word. So that's 29.53. So what is that? 29.53 was the extra. So it's like 63, almost 64 grand. 60 yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then payday two. So let's start with what you're paying the underlying mortgage. And we always pay the mortgage directly with very few exceptions. Mm -hmm. Got it. So uh, we were paying, uh, paying $28.55 and uh, we're actually collecting $29.53 from the buyer. Okay. So this is interesting. I want the viewers to catch us. And we'll talk about the nuances. Not a huge markup from base formula, not an enormous spread. Now let's go to pay. Uh, so total payday two was like five or six grand. Correct. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. not, not bad. Not nothing to write home about. Payday right. three. Um, you had the markup only like 13 or 14 grand. Principal pay down, how much? 42,600. And you use what for a term on this one? The 60 months on this one. You did. Okay, good. And then minus the, the deposit you got of 46 because you don't, you don't count the... Um, uh, 64 actually guys, right? Uh, uh, different numbers. Well, well, we had to, we had to pay 15 up front to help the, uh, the, the seller sorry, get caught. That's why you had that. I'm sorry. So payday mm -hmm. one was the 64 or five minus the, the, the portion went to the seller of about 15 grand. Correct. Okay. Correct. So 46 mm -hmm. is accurate payday one. So you take the, the markup, you take the principal pay down of 42, six minus the 46 and mm -hmm. total payday three is how much? 10,309. Okay. So all three paydays, pretty average deal. Unlike your, the last one we talked mm -hmm. about, this one's going to be around mm -hmm. how much all three? 
65,142. Okay, so the, I, the viewers, I hope by now, whether it's on Smart Real Estate Coach podcast or on these videos, have heard me say a gazillion times, our students run from 45,000 to 250,000 and up mm -hmm. on these deals. And this is right in there, 65,000. Yep. That's pretty cool. Um, okay, that's simple, cut and dry. Let's do this. Let's um, head over to deal structure overtime. And for the viewers, uh, we're going to go ahead and fire up another overtime episode. So head over to smartrealestatecoachacademy.com. We'll fire up another episode and we'll see you there.